Hey, Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for all the support that you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to help everyone learn more about psychology in a digestible way, and you help us do that. So thanks again. Now, back to the video. Have you ever wondered what makes you or other people attractive? Do you believe that attraction is purely based on physical attributes? Maybe you think it has to do with your height, the color of your eyes, or how sharp your jawline is. But attraction is actually much deeper than just your physical characteristics. Instead, other attributes and habits can play a part in how attractive you are. Your personality, mannerisms, talking habits, and body language can affect how much others are attracted to you. So here are 10 surprising habits, which may make you more attractive. Before we begin, we would like to mention that this video is for educational purposes only and not designed to suggest that only these traits are considered attractive. Everybody is different and experiences attraction differently. Number one, you're curious about everything. Do you enjoy learning about how things work? Do you often ask yourself why people behave the way they do? Being curious about the world and having a willingness to learn about how things work shows others that you're open to new opportunities and experiences which is an attractive trait. Number two, you make time for yourself. Do you dedicate time to pursue the things that make you happy? People who are constantly busy doing things they genuinely enjoy usually end up becoming more successful than those who treat their time as if it's worth nothing. This may be because having your own goals, passions, and dreams that are separate from anyone and anything else shows that you're motivated and aware of your own abilities and not dependent on others. Number three, open body language and mirroring. Do you always look away or cross your arms when you're talking with others? This type of closed body language can be off-putting. Instead, direct eye contact, open body language, and the ability to engage and connect with others can all help to increase perceived attractiveness. Also, according to a study done in the Netherlands, imitating and mimicking someone's movement can actually foster feelings of connectedness which make you seem more attractive. Number four, you live in the moment. Are you always aware and present in the moment? According to a study on attractiveness during a speed dating situation, women found men to be more attractive if they measured higher in mindfulness. Number five, you connect deeply with people. Have you ever heard the phrase, birds of a feather flock together? According to Power of Positivity, we're attracted to people similar to us. You may have noticed this most at school when those with similar interests and hobbies spend most of their time together. The more you connect deeply with others, the more likable and attractive you become. Number six, you look for thrill-seeking adventures. Do you purposefully look for activities that would make your blood rush? According to a study in the Journal Archives of Sexual Behavior, single people who went for a ride on a roller coaster rated members of the opposite sex as more attractive. So you may wanna take your date on a roller coaster the next time you see them. Number seven, you exercise and have a healthy body. And it comes as no surprise that your physique plays a part in how others may be attracted to you. While not everybody should be aiming to look like a supermodel or be the next big boxing champion, both men and women do tend to look out for healthy partners. This attraction to healthy bodies may be because healthy partners bring about a higher chance of success at raising healthy children. Number eight, you say thank you. Do you thank people when they help you? Perhaps someone held the door open for you on your way to work, or maybe it's the waitress that was serving you at lunch. Saying thank you is a sign of gratitude and politeness. Not only does it show others that you appreciate their effort, but it also tells others that you're kind and thoughtful, which is an attractive trait. Number nine, you forgive and learn from your mistakes. Are you the type to keep making the same mistakes over and over again? Or do you learn from them and go from there? Demonstrating self-kindness by forgiving yourself for making mistakes shows that you're working towards improving yourself. Studies have shown that psychological traits are important in human mating, with both sexes valuing intelligence and kindness very highly. And number 10, you know your worth. Do you depend on other people to validate your worth? Being confident in the fact that you are intrinsically valuable as a human being and more so because of your character, intelligence, and kind actions is attractive. 
Self-love is the best way to build self-confidence. And there is nothing wrong with thinking, I would make a great catch for the partner who is worthy of me. As long as you aim for an attitude of gentle self-assurance that doesn't cross the line into arrogance. Have you done any of the things we've listed? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and share it with those who might benefit from it too. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell icon to get notified whenever Psych2Go posts a new video. The references and studies used in this video are added in the description below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.